It's round two of the D-Max Light Heats Championship for 2017. We're here at Daytona Sandown Park. The drivers currently going through the heats. Now, this is the closest championship of all six. Just six points between the top four. Cameron Noble, Zach Swannell, Cameron Kahn and Axel Sliepsevic. As you can see, it's already kicking off down the start-finish straight. Let's go into the final and see who's going to take the win. Time for the final of the Daytona D-Max second round of the championship in the light heats. And we've had a pretty eventful one to get to this point. Max O'Shaughnessy, Will Thomas, and uh, an incredible battle in the earlier heats. It did uh, Axel Sliepcevic the victory. Three different winners from the three heats, but it's O'Shaughnessy and Sliepcevic that are on the front row. Will Thomas and Richard Lacey on the second. Dante Dillon and Sam Lovelace on the third. Zach Swannell and Josh Kraft. Luke Roberts and Cameron Kahn after a chain fell off in the third and final heat. While running third, he's only 10th. Bees and Noble, a tough, a tough day at the office for Noble. He's only 12th. Nickel and Warledge, Manton and Hunt. Suter, Weller, Graham Cobb way down in 19th, David Stephen and Dane Christensen. Let's see how this one shapes up. Who's going to get to the first corner first? Let's find out. It's Axel Sliepovic. Sliepovic yeah. has got an amazing start and Max O'Shaughnessy is going to have to chase him down for the first corner. But Axel Sliepovic is going to be an absolute firecracker in this one as he holds the lead with O'Shaughnessy kicking him already. That's William Thomas in third, isn't it? Oh, we got a flag out. Who's that? Someone's fun, what are you trying to check that out? I'll keep an eye on the leaders. Uh, William Thomas there in third place, and fourth place is Dante Dillon. It's George Warledge. George Warledge went off at turn two. He now forms up at the back of the grid, but it's Sliepcevic who leads it. Second place, O'Shaughnessy. Oh, look at, look at Richard Lacey. It's in the middle, middle there of uh, coming down the back straight at Joshua Croft. Oh, on the number 31. Too close. This is Skittles, not Carts, as everybody just about feeds through turn seven. Cameron Khan's in the middle of all of that as well, isn't he? O'Shaughnessy's just lost second place to Will Thomas. Will Thomas has got yes. him, and O'Shaughnessy's trying to come back. And in comes Dante Dillon and Sam Lovelace. They're right in the mix as well. Already, the battle is joined. A three wide going down towards turn one. And uh, is that O'Shaughnessy fighting back yet again? It is. And he runs deep. Will Thomas is back on the inside, and he's going to take the place. Will Thomas is having a great day out. Well, Will Thomas yeah, holds it. Be stuck Dillon's on the, on the inside. O'Shaughnessy's going to get hung out to dry. Here comes Dante Dillon. But no, O'Shaughnessy cuts across, holds on to that third position. And in there, Sam Lovelace as well for fifth. Already it's fisticuffs. Oh no, we've, we've just heard. We've just heard that there is an investigation going on. An investigation for a jump start. Now we think it's one of the front runners. We're not confirming which one it is. We think it's 25. Now if it's 25, that is Axel Sliemcevic. Now if he has been judged to have jumped the start, that is going to be a black flag. Well, there's no doubt, that's, uh, as we look at a replay, there's no doubt he was uh, he got a good start. Well, he, he got a mega the, start. But you can see, he takes the lead as they, before they even get into But is turn that line. a jump start? Is that a jump start? That's the difficulty. That's it's the decision they've got to make. Cameron Noble's on the move. He gets up alongside Zach Swannell for ninth position. I think Cameron Noble's going to get there. Yes, he does. Zach Swannell trying to respond on the way back through, and he's got him back. So Zach Swannell and Cameron Noble fighting for ninth position as they swap. Now, what's going to be the decision with Sliemcevic in the lead of the race? It's tough to tell. They are discussing it in race control. It's an investigation, but is this going to be a jump start? If it is, then that means that Axel Sliemcevic is not going to be able to win this race. He will get a penalty and he will drop down the order. Cameron Noble on the move. Well, where's Cameron Noble been? Yeah, Wait, Noble, I Noble's, even forgot he was out there. Yeah, Noble struggled. He's got past Zach Swannell. Uh, well, it, well, Axel uh, has not been just to a jump start. Right, OK, so, so the investigation uh, has happened. They've decided, no, it is not a jump start for Axel Sliepcevic. So he will continue in the lead of this race. That is good news as far as Axel is concerned. Will Thomas in second place. Max O'Shaughnessy third from Dante Dillon, yeah. Sam Lovelace, Richard Lacey, Cameron Kahn, Luke Roberts, Cameron Noble up to yeah. ninth now in front of Zach Swannell. Some of the seeded drivers down the order. Cameron Noble, the number two in ninth. Matthew Bees, the number six, is in 11th. And uh, Josh Kraft, the number seven, is in... Uh, 13th place. Yeah, so the, the driver. The Graham the, Cobb as well, the number 10 in 16th place. Well, the racer in the middle of uh, Bees and Craft is Charlotte Manton, who's had a horrible day at the office from her standards. She's been shoved around and punted off more times than she can count, but she's still got good pace here. She's within half a second of the O'Shaughnessy's and Sliemcevic's of this world, certainly over the course of the Enduro and the heats earlier on. Her lap times have been strong. Now she's got an opportunity to go for Bees in the inside of turn one. Can't quite get the move done. She'll have to try again in a moment. Tell you what, this is shaping up to be a very interesting end to the race. Cameron Khan in seventh, another new fastest lap. 45 the top, eight. The top seven, just 2.8 seconds. They're getting 
closer and closer. Axel is being caught by yeah. William Thomas, Max O'Shaughnessy, Dante Dillon, Sam Lovelace, Richard Lacey and Cameron Khan. And we're only five minutes in. We've still got another six to go it's, before plus one. If William Thomas decides to go for a move early, then we're going to have seven cuts for the lead. No doubt about it. So it's all in William Thomas's hands. Get ready, guys. Crack open a cold one and get comfy. This is going to be an amazing scrap. The Edgevich, Thomas O'Shaughnessy, Dylan Lovelace, Lacey Khan. Dylan, slowest of the top seven once again. Of course, he has not got a toe where everyone else has, which will explain why he is the slower of the top seven because of uh, his ability. Axel's gap is well. gone. Look, Axel's gap is gone. Will Thomas is right underneath him. O'Shaughnessy is there in third position, waiting for a chance. Dante Dillon is in position as well. Getting interesting, isn't it, in the, uh, the lights final? The Echevich has Will Thomas breathing down his neck. Will Thomas Wait, thinking about a he's, move. He's going to go for it, I reckon, on this lap. I'm not sure he'll go for turn three. He might go for turn five. That might be a cleaner yeah. move. Or, or he might wait for straight. seven. Yeah, yeah, he might wait for seven. But now he's got to get on with it because Max O'Shaughnessy is right in behind him and he Dun will want to go for a move. Dante Dillon is there as well. Sam Lovelace is there. Lacey, Lacey and Khan. There. Cameron Khan is right on the back of this and he is already having a difficult oh, look day. Look Axel Stiechevich Axel defending. is defending. He that's knows it. he can't hang on to this. Right, that's it now. Seven for the lead, any second. Game on. Five minutes to go before we get the final lap board. And Axel oh. Stiechevich has got Will oh, Thomas on the inside. He's Will through. Thomas takes it. Will Thomas gets into the lead. Now he defends down the start finish straight. Max O'Shaughnessy. Closing in on the pair of them. All three of these drivers have won heats coming into this final, so all three of them have a claim for the top spot. Will Thomas, Max O'Shaughnessy in there as well, trying to get past Axel Stiechevich. These three drivers oh, have an amazing the lead. Axel. Oh, that's Axel back Stiechevich, sorry. Back through, he's back through. Will At Thomas drops back in a second four, position. Sorry. Oh, it's so close. Oh, Dante Dillon's there. Look on how the close back it is. This is incredible. They're being towed around. Chain. This is amazing. Look at Axel Stiechevich again. He dives for the inside line. You're not getting through. This is incredible. This is what happens when you put drivers in the same carts with the same engines. You get fantastic Watch Lacey. racing. Watch Lacey. He's going to try and make a move on Sam Lovelace. Lovelace might get an opportunity here in a turn look, one. And look at Cameron Khan jumping in his seat thinking, I've got a chance here. Here we go. This could be a podium for any of the seven drivers in this mix. Stiechevich, Thomas, O'Shaughnessy, oh, Dylan, Thomas. Lovelace, here we go. Thomas. Well, oh. Thomas tries. Well, Axel tried. Stiechevich holds the door shut, tries to kick to the inside line. This is going to tighten up. This could get messy and a couple of drivers could get spat out into the scenery here. Let's hope that doesn't happen. Oh, well, William Thomas. Still trying, and Dante Dillon was having a, a peek up the inside of O'Shaughnessy there. Oh. Now Cameron Khan's going to want to get past Richard Lacey as soon as he can. Yeah, watch for Cameron Khan in and Axel's position. defending Here we go. again. Axel defends. Dante Dillon also defending. Here comes Cameron Khan oh, on the inside of Richard move. Lacey, and he's through. Good Sam move. Lovelace is now going to have the very feisty Cameron Khan all over the back of him. Oh. And Will Thomas goes out wide. Oh, nice. O'Shaughnessy's going to get second position, surely. No, Will well, Thomas gets it. back and covers him off. Axel Stiepsevich has got a, a couple of tenths lead now. Cameron Noble's just done the fastest lap. He's in eighth place. And here comes O'Shaughnessy up the inside of Thomas. That's Gets a through. Beautiful oh, move. And, and Dylan's trying to go through as well. Dylan round the outside. Oh. He's going to make this stick for third position. Dante Dylan is going to get on the podium and he keeps this. Can't quite oh, get no, there. Oh, no, but he's going to be stuck. That's the door, Lovelace. And up comes Cameron oh, Khan. Dear. Dante Dylan's going to get Lacey's... pushed wide. Lacey is going to come through as well. Oh, Khan wide. is coming right round the outside. And he's going to get manhandled down to seventh again. Absolutely incredible. Oh, here, here comes, comes Khan. Khan on the inside of Dylan. It oh. goes up to the inside of Lacey. They bang the tyre barriers. And Cameron Noble's joined the party. Yeah, Cameron Noble's just set the new fastest lap and he's now involved in this battle as well. Oh, bring it on! This is magic! Down to the first corner, the two leaders have broken clear. Sliemcevich and O'Shaughnessy. Sam Lovelace threw in a third position past Will Thomas, as we know. So Will Thomas is down to fourth position. Then it is Lacey. Then it is Dylan. Then it is Cameron Khan. As the repair works go on on turn seven, the, the wheels, the barriers have been completely shunted aside. But now we've got O'Shaughnessy on the back of Axel Sliemcevich again as they oh, battle for the victory. Khan trying to go past Dylan. Can't Dante Dillon's not letting he's, that happen. He's going around the outside. This is where Khan did his move last time. Meanwhile, oh. sorry, further back behind this, Charlotte Manton has moved up in a 10th position. She's worked her way up past Swaddle, past Kraft, past Suter, past Bees, and past Tom Nickel. Charlotte Manton's having a great final. Let's not forget, Zach Swannell was uh, the driver who left the left round one second in the championship. He uh, put it on pole, didn't he? He did indeed. Keen. So, Zach Swannell is no slouch, neither is Josh Kraft. Now we've got the two leaders, Max O'Shaughnessy coming back for more and he's running yep. out of time because we're in the final minute before we go to one more lap. Well surely last lap board is being prepared. 
It might go out next time or two more laps. It's going to be tight. Most. I think we've got two more laps of this, you know. This is going to be so tight because well, it's 11 minutes plus one lap. I think we're just going to get another lap in the board. And that's what we want, really. Axel Stiechevich again defends from O'Shaughnessy. Doing all he can. Going up towards the last corner. Lovelace is in trouble here. Will Thomas is having another crack. And we are going to get two laps to go. Yes, two laps to go this time by Axel Stiemcevic. Must be praying for that last lap board. Come on, there can't be this many laps to go. But there are two to go. 11 minutes is down. Done. So that's the race time over. Now we're on the penultimate lap. The last lap board will come out next time by. Cameron Noble's just had a new fastest lap, 45.7. Right on the he back of Cameron four Khan. tons quicker than... Axel Stiechevic last time. Watch now O'Shaughnessy. Watch O'Shaughnessy. He's starting to give Axel some serious hassle and a big hurry up. Watch Stiechevic. He's going to dive for the inside line this time. You watch. No, he's not. He's going to hang. He's got he a little bit of a gap run, to O'Shaughnessy. Yeah. Lovelace still hanging on in front of Will Thomas. I think Thomas might go for a move in the final yeah. hairpin. That was a mistake from Sam Lovelace going through uh, turn number seven. And no, he's um, not. He's going to no, hang on no. to it as we go into the last lap. Head Sti down for Axel Stiechevic. Head down for O'Shaughnessy as well. Yeah. They banter towards turn one as they dare each other to make a mistake. But Axel Stiechevic is going very well indeed in this, soaking up the pressure from Max O'Shaughnessy. Dive across, he could get you into turn three. He doesn't need to. He's held it very well indeed. Axel Stiechevic is going to get this He's if he hangs on to, to defend, it. surely. He is. He has got he defensive. He knows that Max O'Shaughnessy, well, if he gets into a lead, he's going to be very close. This down is going to come right the way down to the wire with the six carts behind them, all battling. Axel Stiemcevic moves across the cover of the line. O'Shaughnessy, he's going to try into turn nine, I bet you. Watch O'Shaughnessy. He's going all to get one final chance into the final turn. Can he get there? He's going to try and get him on the undercut. Can he get up the grass? No, he can't. Axel wins it. Axel Stiemcevic wins from O'Shaughnessy. Lovely is third from Thomas Lacey, Dylan and Khan, Cameron Noble has to be content with eighth. Absolutely amazing. Lou Roberts ninth and Charlotte Manton, valiant and heroic, gets the top ten. Kraft is 11th from Suter, Bees and Swannell. Nickel, Graham Cobb, way down in 16th. Stephen Hunt, Wallage, Weller and Christensen. What an amazing race. Sam, third place and a popular podium, I must say. A big round of applause for you when you came up. You must be really happy. Yeah, I'm... Um chuffed to be honest it's only my second round at D-Max so um, I've surpassed all the targets really I'm really pleased. So what's what's next what do you think next go for a win at PF? Uh, I think it's important to keep my feet on the ground it's only you know it's second round of, I mean I've been a bit lucky today to be honest but um, you know come the end of the season if I can be consistently on the podium I'll be very happy. Well done you make your own luck as they say now Max that was close just looking down at the times there only within one and a half tenths of Axel, uh, you nearly had him. Yeah, I saw an opportunity to move, but I didn't think it was going to work out, so I thought I'd stay behind him. And the, uh, the gap that we made with a few laps left on the pack behind was very crucial. So thinking ahead then, in terms of the championship, were you? Uh, I'm not sure where I am, but I'm just hoping to get consistent results and get myself up there. And uh, well done, Max. We'll move on to Axel, uh, the winner. A lot of pressure from Max there at the end, but uh, yeah, you must be chuffed with the win. Um, I think the most pressure was from William, actually, sort of in the middle of the race. And if I if I didn't back him into the pack, he probably would have had me and driven off of the race, to be honest. So I think a bit of luck, a bit of strategy, but I think, yeah, very happy with the result. Good stuff, good stuff. Well done, Axel. So that's it here from uh, Daytona Sandown Park. To get involved with DMAX, visit our website or call this number.